Welcome to uh, this episode of March Madness with me and my good business partner, Chris, is it Spinzik? Yes. Spinzik. But we all call you Spin. Yes. Because or Spin Man. Spin Man. Spin, introduce yourself to the camera and everybody watching and I tell everybody what you do. Yep, I'm the Spin Man. I've been recruiting longer than Taylor's been, been alive. To, really and truly, i am been in the recruiting business for 20 years. I spend my time recruiting a lot more on the functional side. Business analysts, project managers, product owners, and, and, and uh, QA folks. Really looking to you, right, because you've been in the market for a long time. I guess tell the viewers, what, what, is the mar what does the market look like now compared to what it looked like five years ago, 10 years ago? It's insane now. What does that mean? It is, there are, I mean, I'm guessing now, but there are probably five or six IT roles for every person in IT now. Nashville's, Nashville's absolutely crazy with regards to the opportunity that's here. Yeah. So, I mean, the madness is real. Talk to me about the market right now. If there's a candidate that is watching this, either in technology, accounting, finance, healthcare, you name it, what would some advice be for them within the madness of trying to find a job right now in this market? One is to explore all the options. I mean, I'm never gonna say that you should only use guys like you and I only use a recruiter, but we make it a lot more efficient and a, and a, and a lot easier to kind of weed through the craziness. Take the phone calls that are that come to you. Don't, don't blow people off or opportunities off or anything because you never know where that right opportunity is gonna come from. Um, do your due diligence, ask a lot of questions, be honest about what you're really looking for and what you really and truly wanna do because that's only gonna help you land where you want to land. If you want to make more money, you have to say, I want to make more money. If you right. want to be in a certain part of town, you have to let us know that. Right. You know, if you're looking for a particular role that is different than what you're doing now, don't just assume we know that we're not mind readers. So a lot of people, and, and you and I have heard this day in, day out, is I don't want to use a recruiter. Um, I see the same job posting on a company's website. Why can't I just submit my resume instead of having to use one of these crappy recruiters? what would your advice be to them? If you submit your resume, the crappy experience that you think you're gonna get from using a recruiter, Amen. <laughs> you can quadruple it yep. just waiting on some sort of response or communication from an organization. I mean, it literally is a black hole. So, so, why, so why do organizations look to us to staff up their teams? The easy answer is, and nothing against anybody in HR that is, that is watching this, because I've got friends who are in HR and Same. we have this conversation. So recruiting in their mind is a necessary evil or part of the job, but they only spend a couple hours a day doing it, where we're in it day in, day out, all day, every day. So they use us because we can bring quality people to the table faster, who are prepared, to, to interview are already kind of pre-closed with regards to the opportunity and what they're expecting. So everything is kind of streamlined from a process perspective using, using recruiters. Yeah. Tell individuals now at this point in your career, you've seen it all, why VACO? Why VACO? Um, particularly, first thing that I'd say is I'd stack our team up against anybody in town. And I know that we'd, we'd absolutely thrash them. We have incredibly talented, incredibly personable, incredibly dedicated people on, on our team. Um, folks that will run through the wall, folks will do what it takes to, to, to get things done. Who's gonna do it better? Yep. Who's going to do it with you, the candidate's best interest at heart? Spin, thanks again for joining me, man. I really appreciate it. Uh, I sit next to you, but it's always good hanging out with you. Uh, thank you again uh, for tuning in to this March Madness episode and the madness of trying to find a job in today's Nashville tech market. Thanks.